Mr. Batty? Are you having a hard time finding moonstones? No problem, I got you. Because today, I'm gonna spill the beans on how do we could get moonstones in Moonstone Island. So why don't you boop that like and subscribe before we start a quick guide? Alrighty, now let's go. There are three ways to easily farm moonstones in this game. Those are through dungeons and treasure chests, selecting the correct skills for chest hunts, and by island hopping. First is the easiest and 100% sure method, which are by doing dungeons and treasure hunts. In dungeons, moonstones drop from blue chests which are usually hidden, as well as the last boss chest, so each dungeon has at least two moonstones. And you shouldn't open the normal chest until you unlock the moonstone master skill which I will discuss in a bit. On the other hand, treasure chests also have 100% drop rate for these, so you should keep collecting those treasure maps that you see lying around. Second is that you can boost the chances of getting more by unlocking Moonstone Minded and Moonstone Mancer skills, as these skills give you a low chance to get Moonstones from any chest. That's right, you heard me, any chest in game, which means that you get a chance from normal dungeon chest, cave chest, and chest from fishing. This is why it's better to do chest hunts when you've already got the skill. You can skip opening chests in dungeons and cave chests until you get the Moonstone Mancer. The last one is a bit of a gamble and can be a bit tedious, but it's effective and it pays off. You can always actively find moonstones by island hopping. It's not 100% sure that you'd get some, but I find it rather fast once you unlock your glider. Just fly in evening starting at 7pm and select a spot that you want to sweep daily. Make sure that you pick islands that are near each other and it's preferable to check smaller and darker islands. There's no need to land on them by the way. Only use your glider to check the sides if there are moonstones. If you don't see any, then you can move along to other islands to save you time. I usually get more than two every night as it's much easier to find them in smaller and darker biomes like the fire and void biomes. And that's about it! If you have any moonstone island guide suggestions, don't hesitate to let me know in the comments. And don't forget to boop that like and subscribe for more moonstone island tips coming your way. Bye-bye!